I'm so excited for Halloween, y'all don't even know. What's up guys, it's Ellie, and today I've decided to take a BuzzFeed quiz to see how basic am I. Honestly, I don't think I'm that basic, but this quiz will figure it out. <clears throat> Alright, it says take a deep breath and check all that apply because it's time to know if I'm basic. Okay. <clears throat> Number one, you don't think you're basic. Tap. Number two, you love bagels. I do love bagels. But I like, like we're having them in hummus because it's like a vegan thing. Um, let's see. You, you love your bagels scooped? No. Um, you wear makeup to the gym. I don't even go to gyms, so joke's on you. If I did, I would wear makeup. Uh, you own a pair of Ugg boots. I do own a pair. I don't wear them. I, I got them when I was like 12. <laughs> Um, you love North Face. I don't know what that means. Um, you can't get enough of different versions of Bare Method. I don't know what that is either. <laughs> um, you own socks from your favorite workout place. No. You have had a yoga instructor change your life. No. You love scented candles. Yes. You have an inspirational quotes Pinterest board. I don't think I do. I haven't touched Pinterest in a while. You had slash have a wedding Pinterest board before you were engaged. <laughs> You have an astrological sign tattoo. No, you love astrology. Yes. That's a good idea, though, the old astro astro so, 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 time. Astro astrological sign tattoo. That's a good idea. I'm Sagittarius, by the way. Um, you've, played <clears throat> you've blamed bad things on Mercury being in retrograde. I don't know what that means either. You've done this, but have no idea what Mercury in retrograde means. I don't know what it means. I still don't know. <laughs> Uh, you love brunch, no. You love Instagramming brunch, no. You love tweeting about brunch, no. You have a brunch group, no. Good God. <laughs> you protested when you thought New York was going to take away bottomless brunches, no. You say margs instead of margaritas, no. I don't do that. You abbreviate a lot of words. Do I do that? It, I guess I do that. I guess, does TBH count? I think, I, was, I say TBH, I say IMO, I say, sometimes, I, I pretend this is ironically, but sometimes I say obvi instead of obviously. It's like, obvi. So yeah, I say I do that. You own the Sex in the City box set? No. You have a fave spin instructor that everyone must try. No, I don't. Um, You've taken your heels off on the street after a long night of partying? No. I've taken my heels off on the, on the street, but not after partying, like during the day. You've drunkenly gotten into a heated discussion over something you have no idea about? No. You've soberly gotten into a heated, heated discussion over something you have no idea about? I have done that. You love vodka sodas because of the lack of calories? No. Splenda is your lifeblood? No. You love Diet Coke? No. You call Diet Coke DC? No. I love Coke Zero. That's what I drink. I'm better than everyone. Uh, you love Taylor Swift. You identify with the song 22. No, I do love Taylor Swift though. You identify with the song 22 even though you are not 22. No. You love Katy Perry. No, not really. I mean, I like Katy Perry fine, but I mean, mm, I wouldn't, you wouldn't, it's not like Britney Spears. You wouldn't see me like freaking jumping on my bed singing to Circus. I mean, singing to like, I don't know, I Kissed a Girl. Well, you could see me singing to I Kissed a Girl. That's like the only Katy Perry song I'm obsessed with. You're pretty sure Miley Cyrus invented twerking. No. You've acted excited about skinny margs. Um. No. Um. Um. No, I haven't been excited about skinny margs. You've been on a juice cleanse. No. You claim you love doing your juice cleanses. No, I've never been on a juice cleanse. What? What is that even? You've cried. I need to detox. No. You've called yourself fat to bond with your friends. <laughs> <laughs> you bought something just because it was designer. Do I look like the kind of person that would do that? This headband is so designer, I must have it. This headband was like six dollars. <laughs> um, you've bought a fake designer something. No, you've gone to Coachella. No, you've gone to Coachella multiple times. Although I do look like the kind of person that would do that. I haven't. You've shortened it to Coach or Cella. No. You worn a headband there? No. You've worn Native American inspired outfits there? No, but I hate it when people do that. 
you don't see that as offensive, I do see that as offensive. You've planned out your outfits extensively for Coachella or other music festivals. Nope, you subscribe to Goop. I don't know what that is. You followed Gwyneth's advice. What? You have an opinion on Gwyneth. I... Are you talking about Gwyneth Paltrow? Is that who you're talking about? I don't... You own a juicer. No, I do love Jennifer Lawrence. You think you're so weird. Um... Yeah, I know I'm weird. <laughs> this... I guess so, I guess. You've read Nicholas Sparks. Oh god, I can't stand Nicholas, Nicholas Sparks. You love Nicholas Sparks. I don't love Nicholas Sparks. I can't stand him. His books are so boring. You have ended a relationship because the person was not in line with the love that Nicholas Sparks portrays in his novels. Oh my god. Do people actually do that? You love the notebook. No, I don't. I tried reading the notebook when I was like 13, I think. Because I had a friend that did and I was like, Oh, this must be such a good novel, all the girls are reading it. And then I like tried to read like the first sentence. I was bored. You watch Love Actually every year during the winter. I think I've seen it, but I didn't really care for it. You've watched Love Actually multiple times during the winter. No, you love getting drunk and watching Bridget Do Jones' Diary. Never even seen that movie. You love white wine. I do not. Sweater weather is a term you use with custom. Yes. God, I love sweater weather. Um, you consider yourself a daddy's girl or boy. Is that... I mean, I love my dad and I do call him daddy and like, I bond with him, but I, that sounds too kinky, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, you love pumpkin spice. No, I actually don't. I mean, I don't like pumpkin flavored things. I like pumpkin scented things, so I don't know if that counts. Like, I do, I do like that, but I, I kind of refuse to buy it. <laughs> I don't know why. I almost bought it the other day, but I ended up getting something that smelled like a cupcake instead. Um, you bought a book because it was one of Oprah's picks. No, nope. you watched The Bachelor and The Bachelorette. No, you know who Juan Pablo is. No, you love Rita Ora. Okay, yeah, I love Rita Ora. You own rainbow sandals. That's a basic thing? Sounds more like a gay pride thing. I mean, I don't, but... <laughs> you felt personally victimized by Justin Bieber even though you've never met him, no? You felt personally victimized by Regina George, yes. You know who Regina George is and love that reference, yes. You have a tattoo on your lower back. That's not basic. That's a tramp stamp. Is that a basic? Is that a thing basic girls get? You have such a cute little tattoo behind your ear. I would never. Okay. One of my friends was like, "Hey, let's get a tattoo behind our ears when we when, when we meet in person." And I'm like, "No, God, no. That sounds painful. Isn't that like one of the most painful places to get a tattoo? No. No. -uh. You've worn sunglasses on the back of your head. I've tried to, but it just doesn't look good on me. You've said chicks before dicks and me to no." You've said that, it's secretly not meant it, no. <laughs> Your nails have had nail art on them. Doesn't right now, no. You love a good accent nail, what's that mean? You love Froyo, yeah, it's healthier than ice cream. You say, I can't even when maybe you can, yes. You use literally very liberally. And it sounds like literally. No, I don't say it like that. I think just fans of Dan and Phil say it like that. You've said, it's almost bikini season. I probably have, honestly. You have lost a single shoe at a party. No, when you get drunk, you find yourself saying, OMG, I love you. No, you've said, OMG, he slash she is so like, insert Sex and the City character's name. No, you said, OMG, they are so, insert girl's character name. No, you never admit to farting. Yeah, it's true. If I do it in front of people, I kind of just start beatboxing. No joke, um, you've, you've told people you never fart. No, no, I'm pretty, I'm pretty honest. Um, you love Starbucks, yes. Your Starbucks barista knows your order, that's not true. You get the skinny version of Starbucks drinks. Does that count? I, can't, I just get the vegan version. You know, I get coconut milk. Um, you've been a sexy version of something for Halloween. <laughs> no. I mean, this year I'm being Poison Ivy, but that doesn't count because she's just always sexy. You love keeping up with the Kardashians, guilty pleasure. I do really like it. I don't know why I'm so entertained by it. I love Khloe Kardashian with like a passion. Um, you actually keep up with them on Instagram. Yes, I do. You have strong opinions over on the Kimye film cover. No, you own jean shorts. Sadly, I do. You've made your own jean shorts. I have not. You were wondering why I was not calling them jorts. I was not. Uh, you love the royal family. I don't care about the royal family. You follow what Kate Middleton wears. No, I don't. 
you've bought something Kate Middleton wore or something similar. No, I did not. You have waited obsessively for the royal wedding. I have not. You waited obsessively for the royal baby to be born. No, I have not. You love talking about, wait, you love talking about loving Chipotle. I've never had Chipotle, honestly, in my life. You only get the burrito bowl at Chipotle. No, I'll tell you what though, Moe's is where it's at. Don't go to Chipotle, go to Moe's. I love Moe's. I love Moe's. <clears throat> You only get the burrito bowl at Chipotle. No, you call it Chipots. I don't want to know anybody who calls it Chipots. You want Chipots right now. No, I don't. You've called someone a basic bitch. Yeah, I have. I have, not gonna lie. My best friend is one, actually. I just always, because, like, we went to Bath and Body Works the other day, and I got, like, something called, like, plum cider, and meanwhile, she was getting, like, all the pumpkin spice things, and I just kept calling her basic. You are really concerned with being basic. I'm not. Show me my results. You checked off 25 out of 119 things on this list. You are not basic at all. You may like a few basic things because you're a human, but are you down and out basic? No, unless, of course, you don't like any of the things because everyone likes them. Because that's pretty basic to do. Oh, you just pissed off a ton of hipsters. Oh, oh, and then it's a gif of Beyonce. Ugh. Whoa, focus, 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 okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to obey that kitten, and I will see you guys in the next video. I'm really hyper today, I don't know why. Okay, bye guys. <laughs>